Well, uh, I guess first, how's it felt to get out there and get camp going? Yeah, no, it's been good. Uh, you know, pace has been high. Guys are excited to be back. Um, you know, so it's good to see all the faces again, um, start getting the feet under us and, um, you know, get that uh, pace up. And, you know, we're uh, moving pretty well out there so far. It seemed like you were getting some reps out there with one of the newer faces, Dmitry Kulikov. What do you what do you like about his game? Yeah, no, he moves it well. Um, you know, he covers a lot of ice. So, um, you know, he's pretty easy to, to read off. And, um, yeah, the first few days it went well. You just missed them. You, were, you got here just after training camp ended last year. And is training camp all that you've heard these guys talk about as far as how hard it was? We've heard that a lot throughout the playoff run. Yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, like I kind of started off is, you know, the pace has been high, and um, that's been a key. It's, uh, you know, just finishing hard and, um, you know, making sure we're, we're kind of leaving it all out there. And, um, you know, we're, like I said, it's the first couple skates, but, um, you know, we're moving well, and I, I think that's kind of the point of it all. Josh, what did last year do for you to be able to come in, be an everyday guy, be a regular, and, and sort of be able to have a chance to establish yourself? Yeah, for sure. I mean, it, it was good. I, I still think coming in here, you kind of, um, you know, always kind of have that nervous energy. And, um, you know, I'm just kind of still trying to leave it all out there. And, um, you know, you never know what can happen. So I think you just, you know, try to put your best foot forward every day. And, um, you know, that, that's what camp's kind of about, guys pushing for spots and, and, and trying to move up. So I think that's kind of the, the big thing here. Where did you see your game grow the most and what, what's the next step for you? Yeah, you know, I just think, you know, overall, especially defensively and, um, you know, kind of moving the puck and offensively, I, I think that, um, you know, being able to grow and being able to play was, was the biggest thing. And, um, you know, of course, I want to take another step and, um, you know, try to, be, uh, try to be a better player and uh, bring a little bit more to the team. You have a unique opportunity here uh, the first couple months with Ekblad and Montour out to really take a bigger role in the lineup there. I mean, what are you looking to accomplish there? Yeah, you know, I think any time, um, you know, those with those two guys out, it's those are those are tough minutes to fill, right? They they do a lot for us, and um, you know, obviously we're gonna miss them, but um, you know that means other guys can try to step up, and um, you know, hopefully uh, you get that opportunity, and you just want to make the most of it. Obviously, there are some new guys, but for the most part, the core from last year is pretty much intact. What does it mean to get back with this group that went through so much only, you know, three months? Of yeah, ago? yeah, it's a lot of fun. I mean, you know, we're hungry. It's you know, it's still been. Uh, it was a little bit of a bitter summer and, um, you know, kind of took a while to uh, to come around to. But, um, you know, it's just nice being back out here with the guys and, um, you know, getting back on the ice and get uh, getting ready to get back to it. I mean, it's, um, like I said, it was bitter and um, last year's last year, but, you know, we're ready to take on the new challenge this year. What kind of reception did Ryan Lombard get today? Obviously a big day for him yesterday. Yeah, yeah, no, it was a big day for him. Um, you know, I mean, that's kind of some of the best part is, um, you know, I see a guy uh, have a new child and uh, bring a new life in and, um, you know, being able to celebrate with him. So I think that's just kind of the brotherhood that we have in this room. How has the dynamic been as far as the defensemen go? Because you and Goss are the only two defensemen from last year who played regularly to return. I mean, how is it trying to integrate with all these new guys and especially with the uh, competition once that glad and Montour come back? Yeah. No, absolutely. I mean, you, you bring in guys that are, um, you know, they're high IQ, high skill and um, compete and, and, and can play. So, um, you know, it's been a lot of fun uh, being able to get on the ice with them and, um, you know, being able to compete with them and, um, you know, just trying to build some chemistry and some relationships with them as well. Last year, you spent a lot of time with a veteran guy who actually wore number seven, right? Yeah. So are you going to be able to, like, take some of the lessons that you learned there and kind of put them to good use now? Yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, I think every every year and, um, you know, every kind of chapter in your career, you try to take a little bit and, um, you know, to be able to uh, bring some of that into this year. And, um, you know, like I said, just a little bit more experience has, has, has helped a lot and um, to coming into my own as a player. So, um, you know, just try to carry that over and, um, you know, kind of bring a little bit more just to be uh, come a little bit better um, in every aspect of my game. Hey, Josh, thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it, man.